welcome all let's make a binary search tree using class we are all familiar that uh, we are all familiar with the binary search tree using struct let me show you uh, we have seen this kind of presentation structure we use for the Representing a binary search tree. Right, nodes star left. So all are familiar with this kind of thing. But now let's make it like let's make a binary search tree using class again. Which tree. Oh, don't forget to make this public the pointers left and right pointers left and right okay. now let's make a parameterized constructor that initialize our object The left and right pointers as null. Okay. Now let's remove this. Then we need a method to insert the data. Okay, so void insert. Let's say we pass. So, in a while we pass data to the object. So if you remember, then we all, we all know that we insert uh, most of the operations in a binary search or any binary tree. We prefer recursion. Okay. So, let's make another function like insert and the data. This is for a simplification, right? We start the pointer. It accepts a pointer. Move left in the data. Okay, whenever the left or right is empty, then create a new object there. So, oh, sorry, let's take this as root okay so this is the boundary condition well, let's, if root is, is null then create a new object with the data that we pass and return root if the root is not null then we need to compare the data less than or equal to root data okay, so if this is the case then we need to assign it to the right of the uh, left of the root so root left equal to insert so when the root left is null it creates a new object and gives, gives back the reference to this one data yes the only condition is data greater than it means we need to put it on the right so right equal to insert root right one data and return root this should work for perfect okay Let's see. Create a pointer. Value of fifty.
Let's run it. So if we have any errors. Oh, well, we have no errors. Let's traverse them. Here we are going. Here we are using. Let's use in order traversal so that we get the data in a ascending order. So traverse if the left is not null, then traverse left. If the left is not null, then the left call the left object we should traverse. So this left traverse. When you traverse, then print the data that it has. So, see out this data. Now we have, we are traverse we traverse the left uh, root, then right. If the right is not null, then traverse right. White object. Okay, let's go full traverse. Now it should print the data of fifty. Let's see. Okay, right. We got it. So let's put some random values into a binary search tree and see if it works. Uh, for that, we need to use the random function. That see if it sees standard ABR. Yeah. Let's insert 20 to 30 values. So for int i equal to 0, let's insert. 20 okay let's see then insert them insert random so we need to insert some random values so ran to get in 0 to 99 100 okay. this should work fine let's run it yeah we got 3 7 9 12 23 but if you see these are all uh, ascending order. Let's write functions for in order I mean, for pre order and post order. Also. Let's rename set in order traversal. In order. There is a function for replace all. Uh, I'm not familiar with uh, this editor. I'm a fan of Vim. Let's write functions for pre order and post order as well. Pre order. P. Post order. But what is in pre-order we first traverse the root and then left and then right so next we call the pre-order post order left right root It's working fine.